to watch the decoy. If you guys hunt um, in water that is dirty like Oklahoma, red, dirt, water, you know, muddy, whatever, your decoys are going to get dirty. And oftentimes this will help clean them up substantially. And it beats the hell out of trying to do it with a rag or whatever. So all I'm doing here is just trying to kind of clean them up a little bit. It's been uh, a year since, obviously, since we since we've really used them and eh, not quite a year but you get my point so uh, you know we're just gonna do some cleaning So for some of you that have uh, are worried about possibly, you know, taking the paint off, I have never never had an issue. I've hunted with these decoys here for three years now, and have never had an issue with paint uh, coming off or anything like that. You know, I think that probably the the best bet is to get them wet like I did, and then just kind of go that route. Um, get them wet. Go ahead and uh, just you know do it lightly like that right there. And then for the hard stuff, that's when I really turn it on, so to speak. So they, uh, now you might scuff them up a little bit when you're doing that, but I don't know. So before you, before you uh, take your decoys and try to clean them off by hand again or whatever this season, don't forget about going to your local car wash and just washing them, man. Um, doesn't take much. You don't really even have to spend the money to rinse them if you didn't want to. Um, but, and of course, like I said, if you guys are hunting Oklahoma, southern Kansas, something with, you know, red, mud, dirty, dirty water, uh, like these teal love, they love that, you know, small water, shallow, nasty. You're hunting that, man. Every year before you start, you know, you just as well wash them off. Next time you, uh, you want to clean your decoys, it's the way to do it. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like, share our channel. I appreciate it. You never know what we're going to have from the tours, uh, storm chasing, tornadoes, tour guests, all the way to hunting, deer hunting, duck hunting, whatever. Um, big shout out to Freelance Duck Hunting. Uh, those guys over there doing a heck of a job. We, uh, we love their channel, so if you get a chance, check out their channel as well. For, again, that's Freelance Duck Hunting. He's got some pretty informative 
informative videos. They've been doing some discussions as of late that I really enjoy. So if you get a chance, check theirs out. All right, guys. Thanks so much.